Scarlet and Gold is a play about the 1912 Waihee strike and a whole lot of members of my family came over. They were gold miners dying over there and they thought it would be better over here. So they were the Aussie stirrers and I'd thought about it for a long time. I knew my great great uncle had start, helped to start the Labour Party uh, but it wasn't until I went to Waihee and saw that that mining town that I realised that this was the story. It's a story that spanks along, it's got a lot of colour, it's got a lot of music and song, it's not a musical, but it, the miners burst into song. It's got the story of people who are desperately trying to make a living and have safe conditions and to make enough money to get by. And eventually there is a strike that occurs with a rift between the two lots of unions and we're away then on that path. They're shipping in scabs from Waikino. This means war. This is an industrial war, people. There will be no violence, agreed? No laws will be broken, understood? We need to talk to these strike breakers. Get through to them, make them understand. The pen is mightier. Our words are mightier. There should be no violence, agreed? You're a bloody troublemaker, Bill Perry. Have been ever since I met you. Strike! 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 It's a story about. It's a story about equality. It's a story about industrial relations. It's a story about heart. It's a story about human beings, and it has something to say today to this country.